It is January 20th, 2023. I am getting another outpatient procedure done. I woke up with this. This is stress, 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 stress. Good morning, stress. Uh, I am, I don't remember the medical terminology for this procedure, but I am getting my fallopian tubes removed. That is right. This baby factory is closed. I'm all dressed in my little, little outfit. So I'm getting my Philippian tubes removed um, so I can get off of birth control as a form of birth control so I can take this Nexoplan out of my arm and kind of just regulate my body and let it be in its natural form with no excess hormones. Um, I know I mentioned like I bleed a lot. Um, with the extreme weight loss, there's just so much going on. So I wanted to get off of birth control, but I don't want to have babies. So I, this was a form of birth control that my doctor presented to me, basically, because you know back in the day they used to tie your tubes. Well, they no longer tie your tubes; they remove them or clamp them. So I will be getting them removed. <sighs> so. That's what's going on today. Um, they said it's it's about seven. It's like six a.m. in the six a.m. and the procedure's at seven. And they said I think it's like a thirty-minute procedure, so it's pretty in and out. So um, I probably got like two hours of sleep last night, and then within those two hours, this popped up. <laughs> so just a little nervous the last day that I will have my fallopian tubes if you don't know what fallopian tubes it is what carries the egg to the cervix to the uterus to the uterus so once you take that travel then you'll no longer have kids because the egg won't have anywhere to go and route to the uterus so take it out just take out the, the fallopian tubes so um i will no longer be on birth control so it's pretty exciting i've been on birth control since i was about 16 so this getting my body back regulated and what it is at its natural form i i don't think i've experienced what i am without hormones pumped into me what you know what I mean like so I'm, I'm kind of excited to see how my body regulates I'm really excited to just kind of see like be natural and not have any kids oops excuse me look at that girl I am skinty look at that Ugh. the other day I was like feeling my shoulders and I was like I can feel all the bones in my shoulders I'm not used to feeling all this. Look at all this. I'm used to, you know, thick meat on me. And look at that. I can just feel bones. If you've been big your whole life, you know, you don't really feel bones. I can feel my ribs, my hip bone. I told my husband, I'm like, do you have hip bones? Like, why do I have bones? So interesting to just feel and see our body and it's underneath what our body looks like underneath all of that fat <laughs> so it's really interesting so the other day I was like talking and I went like that to look at somebody and I like popped myself in the jaw because my bones I'm used to having cushion <laughs> anyway so I guess I'll keep you guys updated love you so much I did not know that's what I look like. Yeah. I look what? Super pale. Like pure see through. Yeah, I haven't. Like a vampire. I haven't had any sun or I haven't got a chance to tan because of my foot. I got my IV in. It hurts. And we're just waiting. She said we're about 80%. Alright, guys, so. 
She's so happy that my veins work. I'm working on stuff here. I'm working on stuff here. Oh, you're messy. Oh, you're really cool. This is the only YouTube short to let people know. <laughs> it's always Don't, what, don't do it with the hat on. Orders and stuff like that. And it's the guy. Okay, guys. So I'm all out. It's 11.22. I've been home maybe like 10 minutes. Um, my husband made me some soup. Chicken noodle soup. They told me nothing greasy or anything like that. My throat hurts. They stuck a tube down my throat. So this hot soup will taste so good. Um, so the surgery room went well. Everything went good. They told my husband that I had a big cyst. Um, I guess on my ovaries that she had to drain. So I'm glad that was taken care of. So this is, so for today I have to eat light, no salads, no greasy food, no nothing like that. So that's what's going on today. It's so delicious. My throat hurts so bad. I'm so hungry. Look at this beautiful carrot. What's that? We will check back in. Very sore. She said it's going to be a lot of gas I'm trying to come out. So we're all good. I'm alive. Hey guys, so it is the end of the night. I just had another bowl of soup. I'm experiencing so much gas. It hurts all right here. I can't lay down, so. In this video, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thank you for the kind thoughts, support, prayers. But we are good, 2023. Love you guys. Good morning, happy new year. This is BSG Chelly. I am working today. This is just a quick video I wanted to show you guys. Um, I am now 154 pounds, still losing weight. Had no idea I was still gonna be losing weight. Um, I had surgery 10, 11, 21. So I'm a little over a year, I didn't. The doctor said, once you hit a year, you should, you know, slow down losing weight, pretty much stop losing weight. So I have these shorts that I wanted to show you. These were my big mama shorts. So if you see here, you see the knot, here he comes, ain't nobody calling him. You can see how far, hold on, look, this is where the knot is. How far these mofos were stretched. they were stretched out because they were stretched to the knot look at that i was up in here stretched now look we're about to get so today oh yeah yeah come now now i just look pregnant <laughs> so we're gonna cut big mama off of me today we're gonna cut it because i need to <laughs> I know what you're thinking. Chelly, why don't you just buy new shorts? No. We're just going to alter these. Let's see. If you can see how big they go. I don't want new shorts. These are sentimental value shorts. Okay, so let's cut it. <laughs> okay. Here's the 260. Oh, look at nice little dainty, skinny, skinny stuff. Maybe I cut it too short. Dang it. Put a little knot. And 2022. Maybe I should. All right. There you have it. We're officially skin tea.